Ooh. Welcome to the Fat Man 56 channel. And today we're going to be reviewing this Jackery 300. Well, when I bought this, I was when it first came out. I didn't talk about it much. It's got it takes a solar panel in there. It comes with a thing for pl to plug in and um, recharge from the cigarette lighter. A big power brick. Now it's kind of it's way bigger than the. I got the 240 out here too, just to show it off some more. But the brick itself is way bigger than the old 240s one. Plus the 240, when I plug it in, this light comes up. Whereas this one doesn't. It doesn't have any lights or anything to tell you it's on. It just works. So the 300 has a cover. Woohoo! Two um, electrical ports. It comes with a USB-C PD60 watt out, which I have nothing for that. A quick charger 3.0. Again, I have nothing for that. When I plug in my 3.0 or my USB charger in here, it freaks out all my stuff that doesn't use quick charging, which kind of is annoying. And it has a one regular USB port. So for me, I only have one port on this whole unit. It's got the light, or the thing, as you can see, it's down. Uh, I was told every few months you want to drain these things down to like zero and then recharge them to keep the batteries in um, balance. But it's basically pretty much the same size as the 240, but this uses MPPT charging, which means it charges way faster. When with this brick, it'll charge this unit at like 84 watts in which will charge in about four or five hours unless you link two of these guys this one and this one together then it takes a while for them to charge because this one unit is charging this one and this one only takes in 40 watts so yeah it's bigger battery faster charging really awesome so what else can i there's not much else to say it works really good i love it i've used both of these in the past year I don't use them every day because I'm not living out of a van or an RV, but we have lost power in my house, and these things have come in real handy. But that's why I have bags. This is the, this costs, I forgot how much, but it's the bag made specifically for the 240 here. But because these are the same size, the Jackery 300 will fit inside this little bag. And the bag, when you buy it, has this nice little pocket up here where I keep all the plugs for the USB ports and stuff to keep them clean. It comes with this little divider here. So you can put, like, the jackery in one spot and the charger and everything in the other spots. And it also comes with a little handle to wrap on these rings over here. And this stupid thing is Velcro. It gets in the way. So, and so that makes like a really nice little bag. And if you don't have your Jackery in there, you could use it for it to store other stuff. But I also bought the Jackery 500 bag. This thing comes like this. It's got, the, it's got another armband. It's got this ring. And you can fit two, both of these inside of this bag. Which is why I bought it. Because I'm planning to get more. See, I can't afford... A Jackery 1000, or well, I could afford a 500 if I really wanted to, but it would take months of saving to get either one of those. But these little 300 and 240s, I could get like a whole bunch of these, and that would take care of most of my electrical needs for cooking and everything. Well, yeah, if I get like ugh, they make. Um, stuff that works with 12 volt cigarette lighters and such they make stuff that'll work with this and 12 volt doesn't seem to eat up a lot of power it can but when i plug in my computer i plugged in actually yeah my computer takes about 180 watts so this thing will be dead in like a couple hours same with the jackery 240 but when i plugged in my ps4 and the vr headset for my ps4 this thing seemed to get as mad, about as much runtime as the 240 with its little 240 watt thing. That was really kind of disappointing. So I'm thinking that it electrifies both of these plugs when you hit this button. 
which could make you lose some more thing, more power than whatever. But either way, it's still pretty good. And remember, I bought these myself. I am not sponsored. Jackery's not giving me anything. Like, I bought this here bag, and it's got a nice little shiny insert. Uh, makes me wonder, yeah, it's just a bag though. Makes me wonder if it's a fair day bag, but I don't think so. And the bag here to keep the 240 in. See, so I'll probably, my electronics are probably going to be about four of these things. And I only have one Solar Saga 100 panel. So the optimum would be to get the, like, the 1,000 for one big long run time, but I can't afford the 1,000. So a whole bunch of little, these little guys. But this is definitely awesome. Now, they've upgraded this since I bought it. This PW60, um, in the newer versions, say in and out. So you could, if you had like, oh, one of these um, Makita uh, USB plugs, and you plug it into the, get a USB-C cable, plug it in here, and then plug it into this little spot, or this little plug, it could give off power to this thing to help keep it going when it's like nighttime. If you have it plugged into your fridge, you're, if you're running your 12 volt fridge off of a little 300 with the in and out on the new ones, which I want to get one, um, you could effectively plug in this thing, which has about 600 or about 180 or yeah, 108 watt hours. So this could help this keep going. In night, I don't know. Take it one time. Hard to explain. I have to, I have to actually do it before I decide. But that's my review of the Jackery 300. It's an awesome thing. I'm glad I bought it. Can't wait to get one of the newer ones, but that's still some time off. And thank you for watching the Fat Man 56 channel. Now I gotta recharge these little guys. Bye bye.